If you've been watching the crypto space over the past couple weeks, you've probably seen a lot of buzz going around about the Audius project. So, you know, the price of their tokens has been on an absolute tear lately, especially since they announced a big partnership with TikTok, you know, the major social media application. And a lot of people talked about Audius being the future of music streaming powered with Web 3.0 and blockchain technology. But, you know, what exactly is it? What kind of problems does it solve? And how does it use blockchain? So that's what I'm going to talk about in this video today. What you need to understand about this project, I'm going to explain this as a blockchain developer who works this technology on a daily basis and also as someone who formerly used to be in the music industry. So this is an important problem that I understand on both sides of the equation here. So before we get into that, you know, if you're new around here, hey, I'm Gregory and on this channel, I turn you into a blockchain master. So if that's something that you're interested in, then smash that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to this channel. And if you want to become a blockchain master step-by-step -step, start to finish, then head on over to dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp to get started today. So what exactly is the Audius? Well, it's a decentralized music stream streaming service powered by blockchain that completely turns you know music streaming upside down on its head because one of the biggest problems with music streaming right now is basically artists get paid basically nothing for streaming their music on these platforms like Spotify and others. And one of the biggest reasons for this is because there's, you know, middlemen that are taking a lot of this value and the artist is getting paid last and not getting paid very much. But Audius essentially turns this upside down and connects artists, you know, directly with their fans. And that helps them, you know, keep a bigger percentage of their pay. And then you have this decentralized blockchain protocol that sits in the middle that automates a lot of the stuff that the middlemen were previously doing that lets them help, you know, get a bigger cut of their earnings. And you'd be surprised what a difference this can make because if you actually peel back and look at the numbers on the streaming revenue for people who have massive, massive hits in the music industry, you might be surprised at how little they actually get paid off of some of those streams. But if you can change how this works and actually get the incentives right, then this could be a massive disruptive force, okay? And one of the reasons that Audius in particular is such an exciting project is because it's really one of the only players like it in this in the crypto space, okay? And look at look at who they stand to disrupt. You have major players like Spotify, you know, Apple Music, SoundCloud. You know, if if Audius could even get a tiny percentage of what these platforms are doing, then this could be major. And right now this is a really exciting opportunity for creators themselves to actually start using the Audius platform because there's just powerful incentives to do this. So basically, you know, anytime a new platform like this launches, the real value in the platform from the listener's perspective is more music on the platform. You know, can they find new music that they like? Can they find existing music that they already are familiar with and want to listen to on that particular platform? So the platform needs that. And that's a great incentive for artists to come on the space to get discovered because you have all these new users on the platform that are searching for novel music. And if your music is right in front of them and you don't have as much competition, then that's way more likely that your music is actually going to get heard. And we'll talk about it here in a minute. There's partnership with TikTok, which is going to take that to the next level. All right. So now let's talk about how Audius works. So it works like any other music streaming platform where, you know, artists can upload content. It's now available to streaming library and other people can, you know, get onto that platform and, and listen to that music. But the difference is basically anytime, you know, a stream happens, the artist is getting paid mostly directly facilitated by this protocol and they get to keep a vast majority of the income that they should receive, receive for that particular stream. But so how, how does it actually work under the hood? Like how does it use blockchain why is that even a part of the equation in the first place? Well, that's what actually allows it to be a decentralized protocol because you might use Audius as an application, but underneath the hood, there's just there's a protocol that's the actual lifeblood of Audius that's powered by blockchain and Audius's uh, native token. Okay, so let's, ex let's explain what that is and how it works. The Audius protocol is powered by different blockchain nodes. So nodes are just computers that talk to one another that help run the protocol. Yeah, any blockchain protocol, that's that's true. But let's talk about how it's the case in for Audius. So there's two different types of nodes. There's a content node, all right? So basically, this is where artists are going to upload the content. And whenever this happens, the node's able to uniquely identify that that content belongs to that particular artist. And whenever a stream happens, you know, where, where this, you know, media is requested and used, then it's able to, you know, pinpoint that back to the artist. That's where the streaming payments can go to. And then once the content is updated, uh, you know, it it gets recorded by this discovery node. And so this discovery node is basically the part of the equation where, you know, people can find new music and it becomes a part of the Audius library. And so this node-based architecture for this decentralized protocol, basically both of these nodes facilitate most of the functionality that a normal streaming service would. And this is what allows automation to enter into the equation to basically, you know, accomplish a lot of the things that these middlemen typically would and thus allow the artists to get paid more. So now let's talk about what the audio token is used for because this is the 
cryptocurrency that's related to the Audius project. So one of the biggest things used for is uh, protocol governance uh, and also, you know, basically functioning as skin in the game for operating in nodes. What do I mean by that? Well, basically, anytime you run these nodes, right, you're a part of a decentralized protocol, and you always want to have an incentive to act honestly, because, you know, anytime there's a redundant copy of this information across different nodes, you all want nodes to maintain consensus to be in sync and not have somebody act dishonestly. So how do you do that? Well, basically, you take money and you stake it or you lock it up into this node and you validate transactions that way. And then, you know, you can get incentivized for running this node. And when you act honestly, you get paid in these audio tokens. But if you act dishonestly, then you would lose audio tokens because they're staked up in this node. All right. And so uh, you can run a node and stake audio tokens that way, or you can uh, basically provide your audio tokens to someone else who's going to stake and help participate in their process that way as well. And so now let's talk about some recent developments with the Audius project and, you know, where it's headed next. So one of the biggest things that's happened for Audius recently is their partnership with TikTok. Okay, so the social media giant has partnered with uh, Audius to allow people to actually share their tracks directly to TikTok. So why is this such a big deal? Well, basically because it introduces some really strong incentives in the equation. So TikTok is, you know, it has, has an insane number of users and I don't have the user count on top of my head. But one big statistic about TikTok is that oftentimes their users discover new music on TikTok. And this is a point of entry for like, you know, top of the funnel going down the rabbit hole and actually creating a relationship with the artist. So there's that. And then you have basically Audius, which is still trying to onboard new artists in the platform. It, it, it basically introduces a very strong incentive for people to come on there because they can now sort of purchase this lottery ticket and throw their name in the hat to get the opportunity for their song to go viral on a service like TikTok and also stand out on the limited competition right now that's on a platform like Audius compared to a much bigger platform, maybe like Spotify, for example. And so those are some really promising things about the Audius project. Now, let's talk about some realistic challenges that it really has to overcome in order to compete with you know, major players like Spotify, for example. So, you know, the platform is still being built out. It's kind of in the early phase, like lots of other blockchain projects, even though it does have a lot of promising long term potential. But for, you know, it truly to be uh, competitive, something like Spotify, it has to have a much larger catalog of music to satisfy consumer demand. Now, right now, it's serving uh, a bit of a niche for sure. But if it's truly going to be a robust music streaming platform, then it needs more creators on the platform uh, to, to really generate that network effect. Because at the end of the day, that's one of the biggest things that gives these other platforms value is that network effect. Effect. And in addition to that, uh, Spotify has some pretty advanced, you know, features that allow you to discover new music on the platform, you know, recommendation engines, algorithms, all that type of stuff. Okay. And Audius needs to be able to compete with that. Even if they have the same catalog, they need to be develop a, uh, an experience that's competitive to a major, you know, music streaming service like Spotify, for example. Now, that being said, one really good aspect of this is that at the end of the day, Audius really is a decentralized protocol. So in the future, basically, we could have, you know, application developers create apps on top of this and introduce new incentives in the equation and also division of responsibilities where, you know, the Audius protocol might be developed by a certain group of people, but then maybe you have a particular application that's maybe developed by a different group that has other incentives that can be competitive and create those types of recommendation engines and advanced user experiences that, you know, the end users ultimately going to want to be competitive with this. And so that's an overview of the Audius project. You know, there's been a lot of buzz about this lately. The audio token's been on a tear. We've seen some pretty major partnerships announced and that's, you know, an overview of what it is and how it works. So I hope you like this video. As always, smash that like button down below for the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. That really helps these videos out so the more people can learn about blockchain. And if you're as fascinated with this technology as I am and you want to get your hands dirty, how can you get started today? You can go to my YouTube homepage. You can find my free courses there. They're like Udemy courses, but they're totally free. And if you like those and you went to the next step, or hey, maybe you want to take a master shortcut entirely, I can show you how to become a blockchain master step by step from start to finish over at dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. You don't have to be an expert to get started today. I've helped people with zero coding experience become real world blockchain developers in a matter of months. So that's all I've got. And until next time, thanks for watching Dapp University.